Good evening, everybody. It's not this 84 Tusis part follows play, Metal Gear Solid. Last time we left off, well, we just, um, we beat Psychomantis right after he, uh, controlled Marinol, and we saved her from being brainwashed, and we was on our way to the, uh, underground base, but, um, before we got to the, uh, to the communication towers, um, Meryl been shot by, uh, by Sniper Wolf, and we had to go all the way back to, uh, to the army base of the tank hangar to get the Sniper rifle so we can use it to fight against Sniper Wolf. And when we beat her, we may notice that um that Meryl is no, is no longer there, and we gotta and we gotta find a way to um to head north and see if we can find some clues to what happened to Meryl, and so and that's pretty much going to do in uh in today's episode Metal Gear Solid trying to find out where they kept Meryl and and what was the meaning of this. Oh, and before I pause the game, like I uh, mentioned in the uh at the end of the previous part, after you beat Sniper Wolf, up this point. It is highly, I mean strongly, highly recommend that you save your game up to this point because um, cause once we make progress, I'm, I'm just going to say, um, let's just say that there's no turning back if you don't save at all, but you'll understand why in a few minutes. So, let's unpause the game and, um, and head north. Let's equip our card. Alright, so we are, so in the previous video, we already uh, called the colonel and, um, and we already called Mei Ling to save our game, as we, as I showed up in the previous video. Oh, and if you try to call Otacon, he's not going to say anything. Alright. Alright, so first thing, first thing, uh, first things first, let's uh, go around the building. Okay, get, get some rations, get some bullets if needed. Got some soak on bullets. And some more bullets under the stairs. And oh my goodness. Snake, get up. See, blowing the stairs, right? Oh my god, man. She must be on her period. Or more like, oh man, somebody's on the rack. <laughs> Alright, so, I'll be honest. When I first played this, I was kind of stuck on this. And I'll show you why I was stuck on this. Because if you go in the first person view, you may notice um, that door is required to have a level 6 card. And I have a level 5 card on me. And I was a little stumped at first because what I did was I had to do a little backtracking and see if I could find me a random, um, random security card somewhere and I couldn't find it. So, I'm going to tell you right now, let's just say don't let the, don't, uh, don't be fooled by this in a way. Because even though I don't have a level 6 uh, key card, we still got to head north to that door and this happens. Yeah, that shit was so goddamn cryptic back in the day. It's hard to miss when you're this close. Yeah, well, I never, I never equipped that um that Solcom pistol with the suppressor. So yeah, we ain't killed Sniper Wolf as we thought. Fool to come back here, stupid man. A lady sniper. And no, they ain't quiet for Metal Gear Solid 5, the Phantom Pain. That's, inter that's good to know, Sniper. Or after your female friend. Which will it be? I'll die after I kill you. Is that the right? Huh. Well, at least you've got spirit. I'm about to say. I am Sniper Wolf. Oh, Julie Moreau. I, I, I was gonna say oh. Snake Spirit could kill her after he kills her. <laughs> Special prey. Yeah, some rule is flirty. Oh, I've left my mark on you. I won't. How do you scratch me? Until I kill you. You're all I think about. Oh! Well, fuck. Take him away. So, yeah, we've been captured. Oh my god, it's kinda of funny how he knocked him out in the in the twin snakes version. Oh hello. Ocelot? Liquid? Wait, Darper Chief? Uh what do you mean by that? What accents with the Darper Chief? Huh. Alright, carry on in. Oh, hello. That's just kind of bright. Can you give me some 
Oh my god, on the on the OG version, of the, on the PS1 version of this, you can actually uh, mess up the uh, first person. Oh wait, I think I did it. Okay, they did kept it in this version. Oh shit. I thought they fixed it in the PS5 version. Because if you move the deluxe joystick and the D-pad, <laughs> this will happen. You get to mess with the uh the, the, the first person is pretty much going out of bounds. Alright, when they stop talking, hit the R2 button. It's no use. Oh. We've taken away all your weapons and items. Don't worry. They're safe. Okay, so uh, if you press the, uh, the R2 button after Liquid stops talking, I also will say something about, oh, we took all your weapons. See, I never knew about this when I played the PS1 version because they never told me about this. Then we'll be able to cure them? No. We still have to get our hands on... You can't even see Snake on that bed. Don't make me laugh. Alright. These shackles are steel. Have they given in to our demands yet? So you hit the circle no. button, um... They won't give in. Like we'll we'll, we'll, we'll say that what he said, what he said just now. Is that your opinion as a kid? He's, he's pretty much saying they that you can't fight because you're strapped on that bed. That's right. That's why they want to avoid any leak about their precious new nuclear weapon. Boss, it looks like our friend is awake. Alright. Whew. There definitely is a resemblance, don't you think, little brother? Or should I say, big brother? I'm not sure. Anyway, it doesn't matter. You and I are both the last All right. surviving Liquid Snake. Of big boss. His real name is Cam Clark, not James Flinders. Get it right, game. Really? Then what? Oof, those idiots! All right, Raven. I'll be right there. Hmm, Raven. Okay. They're not responding to our demands. We launched the first one in ten hours as planned. Damn Americans. Looks like you read them wrong. I'll take offense to that, Sniper Something Wolf. Something funny. Normally the Americans are the first ones to the negotiating table. They must think they've got something up their sleeves. So it's come down to it, has it? We're going to launch that nuke and ride it all the way into history. Huh. I've got to take care of some launch preparations. You're in charge here, Ocelot. What about you? Want to stay for the show? I'm not interested. Oh, on, a on a Twin Snakes version, uh, I was like, he actually flirts with her. He, 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 he literally asked her to kiss him, uh, kiss him on his face, but she rejected him. <laughs> Ocelot, don't screw up like you did with the Chief. Yes, I know. That was an accident. I didn't think a pencil pusher like him would be so tough. Uh, well, again, what do you mean by the Dumper Chief? He died right in front of me. Hypnotherapy. Boss, what about that ninja? Oh shit, it's a, it's a cat meowing outside my window. God damn it. Lunatic. Bastard took my hand. How could he have gotten in here? Perhaps there's a spy. Oh, they talk about the ninja. Mantis is dead. We've also got to find out what killed Baker, an octopus. Wait, wait, Octopus? Oh, so you're saying Decoy Octopus is dead? Torture. This is an interrogation. Huh. As you wish. See you later, brother. So apparently we just found out that Octopus had died, but we don't know how. Oh, hello there. Your woman is still in this world. Meryl. Catch you later, handsome. Once mm. she picks a target, she doesn't think about anything else. Sometimes she even falls in love with them before oh. she kills them. So I thought was staring at her ass. Finally, just the two of us. Huh, I'm still working on chapter 21 my uh Super Mario Continuum fan fiction. Kinda made me think of that one scene of, with uh Amy and Aria. You'll see when it was uploaded on the fanvision.net. Some bed alright. I'm about to show you some of its nicer features. Where are my things? Oh, don't worry. They're all there. Washington was taking quite a chance sending you here. Someone must have had a lot of faith in your skill, huh, Carrier Boy? Get used to that quote, Carrier Boy. So, 
Metal Gear is armed with a new type of nuclear warhead, huh? Why don't you go ask Campbell for the full story? The Colonel? Oh, shoot. By the way, you got an optical disc from President Baker, didn't you? Colonel well, might know yeah. something. Is that the only disc? There's no other data? What do you mean? There's no copy? Do not. That's fine. Is Meryl okay? She's not dead yet. Wolf must have been feeling generous. But if you want her to stay that way, you better start answering my questions right now. You were holding one card key. Yeah. The other two. What's the trick behind that key? Remember that. That weasel of a president said there's some kind of trick to using the key. Hell if I know. Again, remember that. No problem then. We're going to play a game, Snake. And we'll find out what kind of Hi, Jigsaw. We're gonna play a game. Great to bear. Just give up and your suffering will end. What if you do? The girl's life is mine. Alright, so we we're about to get torched by our offline in a Press few seconds. The button repeatedly to regain your strength. When you've had enough. Press the select button to submit. When your life reaches zero, the game is over. There are no continues, my friend. That's why I, that's why I, I recommend you guys to save before you get to this point. If you use all fire, he will kill you. I never tried it, but he will. Cause I, I never own a uh, auto fire controller. You're a tough guy, Snake, but I've got some bad news for you. You know, so he pretty much explained. He, he pretty much explained you how the uh, torture no sequence works. No one so we're gonna be playing some um some canary Mary race up in this bitch for Bear Two Two. We. should be. Okay. All right. So while the torture sequence is happening, I'm not gonna do that much talking because I'm gonna be straining because okay, Irkar is button mashing. All right. Here we go. You like that? Shall we go again? Huh? That's a pretty good odd. All right, round two. Huh? Ow! Will you resist? It's a bit of torture. There's a different outcome. Had enough yet? We're not finished yet. All right. We're in the mix. We're in the fucking mix. Ah, oh God. Uh, ah. You're a strong man. God, I'm fucking sweating. That's enough for now, I think. You're the bosses. Oh God, if you think this is bad, You're race that fucking canary Mary on Major Two and Cloud Cuckoo Land. Then we well, fucking talk. Damn, my fucking throat is hurting and all that. Was not a total failure. Yeah, it's hard pressing the circuit button when you're sitting down, but I can do it when I'm standing up. Jesus Christ. Oh, damn, I couldn't do it in time. Alright, you wonder what that thing is, that snake's uh, gears. I mean, uh, I was already pointed out during the cutscene. Huh? Looks like I got a what? roommate. The Dubber Chief? Oh god, maggots! Oh, this this really grossed my mama when she, wa when she watched me play this. What a stench. Alright, so, uh, meet Johnny Saska again. I mean, we saw him before when we saved the Darper Chief. And for some reason, we found the Darper Chief dead by in the, in the cell. Like, what in the world is going on? I'm just punching, doing some exercise. Oh my god, he's targeting him. Shut up in there, will ya? Shut up in there, will ya? 
All right, just keep staying there until uh, Colonel calls hey, you. Are you okay? I've been better. How's Mara? All right, 15 Snake minutes and we good. Damn. Snake. Ain't trying to drink myself, but my computer had like blue screen on me today. We're trying to like out of the, like out of the blue. Colonel, why don't you stop playing dumb? I'm sorry about that. Well, if it happens again, uh, we'll already make a ba already make a backup save file. <laughs> and the worst thing that could happen is that I, I gotta endure the torture sequence again. Oh boy. Yep, I saw snitched on you. I'm sorry. <laughs> Tell the grunts, huh? You've changed a lot. Metal Gear, secret advanced nuclear weapons research. Oh yeah, I did watch a little bit of the uh of that Nintendo Directs um the CM thing. But I didn't watch the whole thing now. Need to know basis. It's mainly because they, they, they wasn't going to announce any new games over there, so yeah. Nuclear tests are causing quite a stir. Plausible deniability, huh? Yes. And tomorrow, the president and his Russian counterpart are scheduled to So yeah, in two days, uh, I'll be participating in the uh, Lust race. Well, at, technically tomorrow, the time to is uploaded. And that's why we going to race a Prince Peace of Showtime with the CLP heroes. We still haven't even ratified Stark 2 or dealt with the issue of TMDs. This has to do with yeah, I'll, I'll, I'm reputation. still working on my Seagler, Seagler, Mary Teenager, uh, Chapter 20, uh, so one of my, uh, Attack of the, almost said Attack of the Clones, Attack of the, uh, Please Piranhas, uh, fanfic. Just stop them. Why I'm, like, halfway done with that chapter. Hopefully I get it done before I go to sleep, case, and I'll see if I can get up, upload on fanfic.net. I told you Man, I love Amy Art so much in that story. I don't believe you. There we are, like, sisters and sisters. Why don't you give in to their demands? Yeah, you, you see what I mean when I uh, get it uploaded. You see, or is there some reason that you can't? But as I say, there's, there's a bunch of fan service moving that up uh, chapter. But yeah, I mean, it's, it's most like having every chapter with certain don't characters. Want the existence of the genome to <laughs> go public, and that's the only reason. I mean, that's that's fan fiction for you. Huh? Hell with you. I'm sorry. The corpse of the DARPA chief is lying right here next to me. Oh man. Man. But it's strange. He looks and smells like he's been dead for days. All his blood's been drained out too. Yeah, and he died right in front of me. Maybe to slow down decomposition? I have no idea. But the chief only died a few hours ago, right? Yeah, so it doesn't take that long to, for the body to rot out. What could it all be about? Something in his blood that they wanted? Hmm. I doubt it. Just the nanomachines in the transmitter. Did the chief tell them his detonation code? I'm afraid so. It yeah, it like seems like. I mean, he, he said that uh, Damn. that they found out his detonation code. It. it seems that there's some type of emergency override device that can cancel out the detonation code. It's a countermeasure that Arms Tech installed secretly. You have to unlock it with three special card keys. Yeah. And where are those keys? I've got one of them. I don't know where the other two are. Besides, I'm locked up here. We've got no choice. Forget about the keys. Your top priority now is to destroy Metal Gear itself. I'm sorry to have to lay it all in your lap, but you're all I've got. Bust out of there and get to the communications tower. Also, what? I know it's asking a lot. Meryl, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'll save her. So yeah, so Meryl's been captured also. Like Snake said, they got her. But see, if you submit the torture, um, Snake will put on a sad face on the court sequence. Oh yeah, and also, um, Oslo will call you out for, um, for, uh, selling out her life when you submit the torture. And he threatens that he's gonna molest her before he kills her. But yeah. But as I was trying to say, um, depending on the torture secret, there's a different outcome. Because I'm resisting the torture, I'll be going for the true ending, and and go for the bad ending. You submit the torture. Snake, it's showtime. Ocelot wants you. Oh no. Oh boy. Guess what? We're gonna get tortured again. But if you submit the torture, you get tortured once, and that's it. Okay. I'll tell you once more. Press the circle button repeatedly to regain your strength. When you've had enough, 
Press the select button to submit. That's the mercy. I am. I am safe. Zero. The game is over. There are no continues, my friend. I fought wars and. Yeah, I. I am safe. The moment I. I came to myself. Oops. And Chad. <laughs> Among the Mujahideen guerrillas, I was known and feared as Shalashaska. I was trained by the Russian group. I am not like one of those KGB slugs. See, I'm so used to not saving doing my recording sessions, but yeah. Sport. You're all just a bunch of sadists. Don't confuse me with those uniform fools. Well, shall we begin? This better not buy me the okay, ass. Here we go. Okay. How did you like that? And we can't even pause doing this. Again? My thumb is slipping. Yeah, my brother used to, used to use a lighter on the circle button, yeah, but I'm not doing that. I use my yet. thumbs. Oh, got my arm. Oh, God, foot. Okay. I thought I was slipping. I had to blow my eyes out so I could feel confident. Well, that's enough for now, I think. We live in a sad age. Imperialism, totalitarianism, perestroika. 20th century Russia has had its share of problems, but at least they had an ideology. Russia today has nothing. They're struggling between freedom and order, and with that struggle, a new spirit of nationalism has been born. The boss has a close friend high up in the Russian government. He's currently the head of Spetsnaz. He's agreed Spetsnaz. to purchase this new nuclear weapons system. The Hind was just a down payment. So you're in this for money? I don't need money. I want Russia to be reborn, to lead a brave new world order. Huh. New order. Mommy, the uh, WWE vibe a little bit. Alright, I might, I, I may say, guess I screw this up. All right, so we're back in the cell. Shut up! Shut up! All right, now we get a phone call again. You okay, Snake? Yeah. Nothing new to report. Snake, is there anything I can do? Yeah, my arm hurts. Poor Snake. <laughs> my hand kind of hurts a little blood. bit. Okay, but you can leave out the Benzedrine. That stuff makes me too frisky. <laughs> I guess you're not feeling too bad after all. Snake, put the Oh yeah, I'm, I'm about to point out that uh that it's playing the same music Don't from worry. the dock. It'll feel good. When you start this game. Okay, here I go. I I'm literally putting the PS5 controller on my arm and she's making it vibrate. A better? How did you do that? I stimulated your muscle fibers with the nano machine. But yeah, if you have the vibrator to turn off then then she kind of she skipped that little dialogue. Say something to take my mind off the pain. What can I say? Anything. I. I'm not a very good talker. Please. Shit, me neither. I mean, Tell you me guys should hear me talking right now. <laughs> That's a tough one. Any family? <sighs> That's not a happy topic for me. I don't have any family. No. Shoot, I Please. lost both my parents, so we're kind of on the same page. Where is he? Dead. By my own hand. Big Boss. Big what? Boss. Big Boss? I had no idea. There was no way you could. Okay, now it's playing the uh, best is yet to come in the background. Only Snake and I know the real truth of what happened there. So, is it true? Was Big Boss really your father? That's what he said. That's all I know. And you were able to kill him? Knowing that? 
Yep. I do love this song, though. How? Wanted it. Besides, some people just need killing. That's petricide. Yep. Mm-hmm. That's the drama that Mantis was talking about. Yup. One we share in common. Is that why you left Foxhound? Let's just say that I needed to be alone for a while, and Alaska was the perfect place. <sighs> Snake. I didn't have a real family either. Just a big brother who put me through school. We weren't even blood related, and he yeah, was Yeah, they kind of had father issues, him and Mantis. Where is he? He's dead. Oh. I'm sorry. Snake, is there a woman in your life? After you've been through as many wars as me. Yeah, this right now. Hmm. So hmm. jealous. Roy Campbell. <laughs> You're still calling me friend? Is that it? No. There was another. Yeah, I Roy came up better. What? Big Boss's most trusted lieutenant. And the only member of Foxhound ever to receive the code name Fox. Gray Fox. Yeah. Uh oh. I learned a lot from him. But there's a reason why um uh, Nomi had that true. ellipses. We did, in Zanzibar. But it was nothing personal. We were just professionals on opposite sides, that's all. And you still call yourself friends? Hard to believe. War is no reason to end a friendship. That's insane. I first met him on the battlefield. Uh huh. He was being held a prisoner of outer heaven, but he didn't look. Oh, yeah, right. I believe he appeared in uh, Metal Gear 2: Saw a Snake. So cool and precise. I was still green, and he showed me the ropes. You knew him well. No, we never talked about our personal lives. Sort of an unwritten rule. Hmm. The next time I saw him on the battlefield, we were enemies. We were fighting barehanded in a minefield. Yup. I know it sounds strange to most people, but we were Is just that the time um, we fought the ninja job. at the lab? That wasn't like the first time they fought. Men in their games. You're like wild animals. You're right. We are animals. So if you were friends, then how do you explain the ninja's behavior? I don't know. <sighs> it's your genes. They make you predisposed towards violence. You really like talking about genes, Naomi. Why did you get into genetic research anyway? I never knew who my parents were, or even what they looked like. Huh. I guess I got into genetics because I wanted to figure out why so I So she never saw her parents. So you studied about DNA? <laughs> yeah. I thought if I studied my genetic structure, I'd find out who I really was. I thought that by analyzing a person's genetic information, I could retrieve the blank spots in that person's memory. Memory is stored in DNA? We're not sure, but we know that a person's genetic fate is determined just by the sequence of the four bases in their DNA. So what about my fate? You know my DNA sequence, don't you? Your fate? I... I'm sorry, I have no idea. Of course not. You're a scientist, not a fortune teller. Alright, let's see what Ming Ling has to say. Snake, are you okay? I feel so scared for you. It must be horrible. Yeah, I, I've been through a lot worse. Believe me. Yeah. Oh, you really are a hero. It's a good thing the codec is connected directly to your inner ear. You can contact us anytime. It's always nice to hear that you're alright. Why don't you contact the Colonel? If anyone can think of a way out, it's him. Well, we, we already spoke to the Colonel. Weren't you listening? Now we gotta back up safe for all case things go wrong. Please, Nick, don't give up. So we're not gonna give up. Well, we didn't we didn't submit, so we good. Shut up in there, will ya? Shut up in there, will ya? Uh oh. Well, we gotta take a shit. You know, in the bathroom. So yeah, so you can wash off to the bathroom. Now we rush to the bath. Now you don't really have to do this, but um, we're gonna call Otacon because I like doing this. Just to make it dramatic. <laughs> Otacon, are you still okay? Yeah, thanks to the stealth camouflage, that is. I have a favor to ask. I need your help. I was wondering when you'd ask. What should I do? I've been captured. I'm locked up here in this cell. What cell? 
there's a big torture machine nearby. Okay, I know it. It's close. I'll be there right away. Thanks. Alright, as I was saying, you don't you don't necessarily have to call Otacon to, to ask for help. Even if you don't contact Otacon, he's he's still gonna show up. But I just love calling Otacon just to make the scene a little dramatic, don't you think? Alright. Snake away for Icon to show up. I'm here. Where? It's right in front of us. Alright, now we gotta check this cutscene. Wow, they even capture you. Hurry, get me out of here. Let me go. That hurts. Hurry up. Oh shit. Can you ask a guy a favor? Let me go. Jeez, it's like an animal's cage. Oh, what a smell. Because of him. Yeah, it's uh. chief. You don't hurry up and get me out of here. I'll be laying next to him. Those bastards. Yeah, cause they bug man. They they smell pretty bad. You need a key like the soldiers carry. Especially when the freaking mouse dies. Oh my goodness, don't get me started with that. I I thought you might be hungry. If you need more food. Hey look at the Heinz ketchup. Also, I got you this level six card. It'll get you out of that torture room. Alright, so that's how we get that level six card. Take this too. What's this? It's a handkerchief. I got it from Sniper Wolf. Why? I don't know why, but she's nice to me. Sounds like Stockholm syndrome to me. But she didn't kidnap Otacon. After the terrorists took over the Sniper Wolf is not a kidnapper. That's what Stockholm Sniper syndrome Wolf is. You fall in love with your kidnapper. She even let me feed him like, like when that chick fucked that man in love in 365 days after he kidnapped her. Yeah. Please don't hurt. Right, right when that boat. She's the one who shot Meryl. Well, that's all I can do. They're planning to launch a new Yeah, he's been in love with Sniper Wolf. You have to get past the communications. Otacon. First, you have to get me out of here. Come on, I'm trying my best. That guard's got the key. You'll have to take him out. Give me a break. I'm no soldier. I can't take anybody out. You have to. I'll be killed. The yeah, Akka's not a killer. Oh, jeez. He's coming back. See you later. Wait. Alright, so, um, Giant Saska is, uh, is coming out of the bathroom. So we gotta do, we just gotta hide, hide under the bed. Or you can play dead and let Johnny Sasuke check check up on you, then you escape from your cell. Now, if you keep on failing to escape from the prison, you're gonna to get tortured by Oslot again. <laughs> then you gotta then you gotta find a way to, to escape from the cell again, but if you if you if you have a hard time getting out of the cell, then the ninja will will uh will save you. Alright. Oh my god, like how the fuck can you see you? Let's get that ration and get the fuck out of here. Waste my life with that ration. And you gotta take a shit again. Alright, now just for fun, if you go to the door and knock on the if you knock on the door. Yep, you can hear him taking the shit. Saying, ooh, ooh. Okay, where is my, um. Oh, okay. So, what we gotta do now is just pick up Snake's gear. And put the sneaky suit on. Okay, let's call, uh, Master Miller. Now that you've got your stuff back, you should take a good look through it. If you're slow equipping an item in battle, it could mean death. Oh, there's a hint for you. There's a hint for you because, um, if you go in your inventory, you may notice that asshole Ocelot planted a bomb on you. Oh my god, I keep thinking, I keep thinking, thinking this is, uh, I keep thinking of something else every time I look at that wall. All right, so yep, you have a timer in your in your sneaking suit. So what we're gonna do is that we're gonna um, with his circle, get rid of the bomb, 
Okay, let's get the hell out of here. Okay, let's just put guns up there. Oh! Keep hitting the, keep hitting the wrong goddamn that button. Was a close one, Snake. Ocelot. You'll pay for that. Alright, you know what? We're gonna do a little exploring. Now, we're supposed to go to the first floor of... We're supposed to go to the first floor of the tank hangar, but, um... We're gonna go back to the basement, too, because you may remember, um... When I went and got that camera... There was a door I couldn't open. So, we're gonna... We're gonna, we're gonna uh... Go to that door right now and see what's beyond that door. First, let's, let's get some bullets from down here. And be careful not to uh, trigger the uh, sensor like we did last time. Alright. So we fall on the, uh, on the famous. Alright, we're gonna go back to that room where we, uh, where we saved the uh, beggar before he died on us. Alright. Alright, how many how many seaports do we have? Okay, we got ten. Alright, that's a door that we couldn't open before. Oh god. Alright, we got stun grenades and trap grenades. Alright. You know, I could get another ration from the, um... I can go back to the, uh, first floor basement and get that, uh, ration. But you know what? Nah, I don't want to do that. Because I don't feel like dodging the, um, those, um, cameras with the guns on it again. Alright, so I, I already know about, um, uh, well, there is another, uh, submitted wall that we never, um, blew up. Up north, but, but I'm, I'm actually going to ignore that. Alright. Now we fool on C fours. Alright, watch out for that trap door. Alright, now to the first now to the first floor of the tank hangar. Alright, so now we gotta go through the canyon, like before. Nah. Well, ain't not much we can do here. And remember, the, uh, the census is off. <laughs> okay, so when we get to the nuclear storage building, we will, we, well, we will go to the, um, go to the second floor basement of the, uh, nuclear storage building because there's another door that we couldn't go to before. Alright, let me get that claymore. How many claymores we have? Okay, 11 out of 14. I don't, I don't, I don't want to waste any time getting any claymores. Right, I believe there's a ration under here. Nope. Nope, they didn't respawn. Okay, there's something over there, but we're, we're going to ignore that. Because we're, we're full on st stun grenades anyway. Alright. You know what? I think I know where I'm gonna start the video at, but yeah, we're gonna keep on going until we view an until we um view another cutscene. Alright, I'm actually gonna save here again. Just to play it safe. What is it, Snake?
Because if I, if I get spotted, then I'm going to blow my safe all. The Chinese say it is the strong swimmer. I guess it's, I guess it's all the uh, trivia fun fact. It is because the strong swimmer overestimates his abilities and underestimates yeah, his I mean, after this, I'm about to eat me some You're green beans. The one that Jeppy now, hates. But don't get careless. So I got done eating me a turkey and cheese sandwich before I got re before I, before, uh, start recording. I almost said got done recording. I mean, I'm not done recording yet. As you see, I'm still playing the game. I'll be done playing once you see the video ends. <laughs> Alright. I got hop in that camera like we did before. And take note that door below us, as I pretty much mentioned last time. Alright, let's just wait until um, the, the guard goes away. Oh yeah, I did watch the uh, All American Homecoming yesterday. What else? Oh yeah, I, I finally started to get back to watch the uh, watch the The Knuckles Show on Paramount Plus. Yeah, I did watch the first episode twice because when I watched the first episode, I was having buffering issues. <laughs> now I got done watching episode three where uh, Knuckles and um and that Wade guy they were, they was pretty much on the lam. Alright, let's go back in that hallway where we need the gas mask. Okay, there's some rations. Oh, no, we're full on rations. Alright. And the reason why we're down here because, it, like I said, there's a room that we haven't entered before because um, we had the level 6 uh, key card. Alright, so this... We get the body armor, and with the body armor, uh, you'll take um, you'll take less damage. And I'll show you. All right. Well, now the can now the cannons want to shoot me. I guess I'll take damage on purpose to show. Up. So yeah, so yeah, you'll you'll take you'll take less damage um when you get attacked when you get uh when you get shot with the body armor. Okay, we really got to we really got to get the fuck out of here. This OCD shit is it's really getting to me. Ah shit. All right, we really got to get we really got to get the fuck out of here. This OCD shit is going to be my downfall. No, we can make it. We got plenty of time to get out of here. They need to do something about that fucking gas. Oh, they'll do something about it. Well, you ain't, you ain't gonna see it. You ain't gonna see it again in um in the uh, Metal Gear Solid Four: Guns of Patriots. Ready to kill some guards? All right. Now normally, if you submit the torture, up to this point, Snake would be sneezing. Alright, may go night night now. Besides, there's some more rations up here. Alright. What else can we collect in here? Yeah, we're full on snug grenades. Another version is needed. Level 6 card, and that gives us the medicine in case we get sick. Because normally, a uh, snake will sneeze if you submit the torture. So we don't have to worry about that because I resisted the torture. Got some more Soul Calm bullets. Yeah, probably not going to use the Soul Calm anymore in this, uh, throughout this run. Because this is how I always played Metal Gear Solid back in the day. So yeah, I guess we got time to see that one last cutscene. Not the final cutscene of this game, of course, but um, the last cutscene of this video before I end it. I like to be more, I like to be specific, you know. 
This music right here feels so ominous. Alright, don't forget about the box trick. Oh yeah, the wolves can actually jump over that. Oh my god, when I first played, I didn't even knew that. I didn't even knew that uh that Alka was a ludge, which means that Snake he could have easily um climbed over that. Just want to show off the camera for a little what for a little bit. All right, now now let's use the uh use the cardboard box. You can use any cardboard box because I um I had a dog piss on both of them. Got some P got some uh, PSG one bullets. All right. Now, um, let's try this again without failure. So now, when we get to the spot where Meryl got sniped, this cutscene will happen. And after this cutscene goes off, we're gonna save our game and call an episode. Oh man. I love that flashback. We expect no offense. Yeah, war is ugly and war changes people. That's a true fact. Snake, about Merrill. Colonel, I'm sorry. Listen to me. I wasn't able to protect her. Oh, me neither. Snake, she's a soldier. She knows that prisoners are a part of war. She joined up of her own free will. I'm sure that she, she was did. prepared for this. No, you're wrong. Meryl thought she had to become a soldier. Thought it was the only way. She said she thought it would bring her closer to her dead father. She said that? She wasn't ready for real combat. I shouldn't have pushed her so hard. It's all my fault. It's not like you, Snake. Master. Oh, hello, Master Miller. Sorry for eavesdropping, but I just couldn't listen anymore. Master. Well, you don't you got any sympathy or what? You regrets if you want to. It's only natural. But you can't keep attacking yourself for things that happened in the past. Okay, well, you ain't wrong about that, dear Master. Believe me. He's right. You ain't wrong about that. It doesn't suit a That's my like uncle. You. We all I'm drunk sure and shit. Fine. Mei Ling. Snake, forget about Meryl. Stop Liquid. That's what Meryl would want too. Yeah. You're right. That's Meryl true. Would say the same thing. Snake. What? Meryl, she's pretty special to you, huh? Oh my God. Yes. I'm she telling you, man, she's jealous. There aren't many women like her around. That's not what I meant. <laughs> That's not what I meant. Oh my God. That tone to her voice. Come on. This is like a police. <laughs> that tone of her voice. He said well, that. I guess it's in the genes. The genes? What are you talking about, Colonel? <laughs> no. I just remembered about Naomi's grandfather. I think Naomi said he rose as high as assistant secretary in the FBI during Edgar Hoover's time. Is that Edgar right? Hoover? That, yes. that racist he, man? He was uh, Japanese, and he became a special undercover investigator to... Yeah, my dad life. hated Edgar J. What Hoover. Oh, uh, sometime in the 50s... Edgar J. Hoover, I'm sorry. Where? A New York, I think. Naomi. I okay, why is she stuttering? Family. Well, I, I researched it after I became an adult. My grandfather was Sorry, she dead panicking dead and, and she wanted to change the subject. To and trying to dance around the oh. questions. Snake. Good luck. Watch your back, Snake. Alright. 
Alright, let me save my game. And let's do uh, Mei Ling's um, trivia fun facts. Because I, I think it's a good idea to save this for the, um, for the next video. Yeah, most likely, of course, some, most likely, call more is next week because, um, gonna be, gonna be, gonna be going to be going to be going a little. Yeah, recording the game of Dust Joe's the day after I re, I record the um, the last race with the uh, Super P heroes. So yeah, it's gonna be a busy week for me. There's a Chinese proverb: the mind cannot be in two places at once. Make sure that you're not thinking of something else during the mission, okay? Uh oh, you're gonna tell me that multiple times, uh, sweetie, because I. Always get sidetracked. I mean, you haven't seen me play games like Tears of the Kingdom, Banjo Kazooie, God of War Ragnarok, Final Fantasy 7 Rebirth, which I'm currently less playing. Oh boy, should I go on, Mei Ling? Should I go on? <laughs> Alright, let me pause the game. <laughs> I think we all get the point right now. Alright, so yeah, so we made some decent progress in tonight's episode. We got torture and all, and, and, um, we we survived the torture. We resisted it, and we pretty much saved Meryl's life. <laughs> Let that be a hint for you guys. But yeah, so yeah, I might as well I might as well say that we pretty much saved Meryl's life up to this point because we uh, resist the uh, torture and we already locked the true ending. And so that's pretty much that in a nutshell. And we're about to go to the community. And we're about to go to the uh, communication tower to find the underground maintenance base so we can stop Metal Gear Rex before they. Launch that nuke they be bragging about. Alright, so next time let's play Metal Gear Solid. We're going to make our way to the uh, communications tower. And get past the snowfield. And see if we can find the underground maintenance base. So we can put a stop to Metal Gear in the launch operation. And then we're going to see what's in store for us. So until next time everyone, Celtics A42 out.